Hi beauties, how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me. Welcome back. So today I'm doing a collab video and I have joining me today Kathy Beauty Care Chats. Um, I also have Heidi Ann and Dawn's Life Over 40. We are doing a collab called Let It Glow and basically it is the products that we use in around this time of the year when summer's gone and we want to give that extra maybe glow or find something to help us keep looking the youthful glow and so we're going to share our products with you guys in what we use and what we love to use uh, to get that look so if you guys are interested in seeing my pics keep on watching So if you guys know me pretty well by now, or if you're new to my channel, you might not. And I am somebody that really likes to go for a nice, youthful, healthy glow. Uh, I don't go towards the matte look. Sometimes I do. I will do that once in a while, but very seldom do I. I mostly do go for a nice, glowy, luminous, dewy, maybe kind of looks. And especially around this time of the year, my skin gets extremely, extremely dry. And I try to use certain products to help keep it moisturized or keep it looking that healthy glow. In the spring and summer, I don't have it uh, too bad because my skin is in between. It kind of is a combination of dry to oily because I get oiliness in my t-zone. So I asked several ladies here that I got to know who wanted to see what they used because I'm hoping each one of us have something for everybody out there that might feel the same way as we do or you know enjoy having that glow youthful look. So I have Kathy Beauty Care Chats who I have collabed here with before and have become very good friends with and then I also have Heidi Ann who has also I have collabed with and have recently really got to know. And then there's Dawn's Life After 40. I really enjoy her too. I've really been watching a lot of her videos and I don't know, like I know Dawn gets into a lot of the healthy organic kind of products and so I thought she might be able to help for a lot of people with that. I do use some products, but I'm all over the place. She's more into a lot of those kind of things. So she might have some items for you guys that do look for that. And they're all wonderful, lovely ladies. We're all mature ladies in the mature community. Go and check them out. I have links to each of their channels down below. Go and check them out, show them some love and maybe subscribe if you like. I know you're not gonna be disappointed because they just, Add, keep adding to that chain of us beautiful, mature women and men out there and our love for the beauty community too. So go and check them out. Links will be down below. All right, I'm gonna get into mine because this is gonna be, I do have quite a few products. I didn't realize until after I started scattering through thinking, well, that does, that does. And I did tell them it could be makeup and some skincare because there is some skincare products that can give us that healthful, youthful look. My skincare does change from uh, the spring and summer to the fall and winter. I do extra, definitely extra moisturizing. My goodness, this, I have a bad feeling. I have a feeling it's gonna be a bad year for me and my skin is just gonna go haywire. Skincare products will do a little bit of body first. I don't have too many body products to share. recently picked this up, the Equate Moisture Care Cocoa Divine Body Oil Gel, and it helps give a skin a healthy, glowing appearance. And I know Vaseline, you know, the company Vaseline sells, but also here's the Equate one. And like I said, it smells like butterscotch, literally butterscotch. And I put it on right after, like maybe at some point when I get a shower and it smells quite lovely, but also, yeah, it just gives my skin and up and around here, like it just looks a little more glow to it and just makes my skin look a little more healthy. And I really like it. Really nice product. 
another item that I got to thinking because I do have some body scrubs that sometimes can give you that youthful, you know, because once you exfoliate your skin, some of the moisturizing oils and different things that's, that are in these body scrubs can sometimes give you that too. Uh, I do this a little more extra right now. Like summertime, I still do because I do get dry skin, not that I don't. Um, but right now, yeah, I'll go hardcore intense. So I'll be picking more of these up. This one's my Moroccan Rose. I do like the Brazilian nut or whatever that one's called. So I would say to check out Tree Hut Scrubs. I love those. As you guys know, I show them quite a bit. Now this is new to me and it's from Ofra and it's a body illuminate illuminizer, which a lot of these kind of products like this, a body illuminizer, Jergens even has some, I know, for uh, glowing, you know, like little bronzed glow. This one here had a bronzeness to it also this here. So anything like this, if I can use, I'll put it on my hand here for now. We'll put it on my hands on both of them here. And anything like this definitely can give you that nice, you know, glowing appearance. So any kind of body illuminizer, something like that, or like I said, Jergens has some uh, body moisturizers, like a bronzing kind. Um, you know, some people like to still self tan and bronze. I haven't done self tanning in so long, like three years now. Okay, the next product I love, and it is the Body Shop Ethiopian Honey Deep Moisturizing, no, Nourishing Mask, Nourishing Mask. And this is that honey mask that I tell you guys a lot about from the body shop. I do have this one. I have a rose one. I do really enjoy these masks from the body shop, but this, oh my gosh, every time I use this honey mask and, you know, like leave it on for like the 20, 15 minutes or whatever it is. And like, I'll take a, a cloth, like a warm cloth and, you know, like dispense it off and everything. I always have this beautiful, like fresh youthful skin every time but any kind of honey mask you can look and see but this one i know really gives me that like every time never never fails me and it's like oh my god like my skin looks alive again or something so i really love this one and this product here i used before and then i just kind of never got it again. Why, why I don't know. It wasn't because it never worked or anything and I did like it. And it's actually from the company L'Oreal. It's the Age Perfect Hydrating or Hydra Nutri... I even say this. Age Perfect Hydra Nutrition Facial Oil with sunscreen of a broad spectrum SPF 30. So it has sunscreen and this oil on top of it all. And it has several different oils in here. You know, it did list on the box. I don't have the box, but it lists on the box when you see it, the different kind of oils. There's like 10 different kind of oils in it and everything. But oh my gosh, this is not a thick oil. It's not like heavy feeling. It's a light, light oil. And you put like about four drops on. Okay. Yeah, there's a little bit, there is a little bit of a fragrance, but it's not too hard but yes this just goes really nice melts into the skin it glides on nice it doesn't feel heavy it's not one of them heavy oils so if that's something you're worried about too oh my gosh yes it has been really making my skin look a little extra glow to it really like that product I know everybody's been talking about this company a good bit and for good reason. I have seen it from a lot of my friends here on YouTube and it's the Nudu company. And then, yes, they did send me a lot of their products and I might do a little more whatever in another video and talk about them. And probably one of my likes and not likes video, I'll probably talk about them a little bit more. But 
yeah, they sent me these, and these are the moisturizers. One is the Ultra Rich Moisturizer, and then the other one is the Overnight Radiance Renew Cream. So yes, I love the Radiance Cream, and I love the Ultra Rich Moisturizer. Ugh, I will talk about these a little bit more in a video, but yes, these I am absolutely falling in love with. Let's get into some makeup products that I have that help give me that glow. And three, three uh, foundations right off the top for me are foundations that I love to use right now, more now than I do in the spring and summer. And one is my Illumination It CC. I talked about that several different times. So the It CC, the Illumination one. Love the Bourjois Healthy Mix Foundation. This does definitely give you gorgeous glow finish. If you're somebody that likes matte, this won't be your foundation. If you like the glow and luminous look, this would be your foundation. This is great for mature ladies that really do have dry skin. So the Bourjois Healthy Mix, love that. And then the other one is my Josie Marion uh, Vibrancy Foundation. I know it's not, not everybody really liked it, but I think it just depends on your skin, like with anything, it, it, if it works for your skin or not. But again, for mature ladies, yes, because it has the argan oil in it and all those good things. Plus, it gives you that beautiful, healthy glow. A couple of primers that I have here that do do help on certain days. Like if I didn't use those ones, and I did use maybe my Clinique foundation I have, um, then I'll use these primers. And this one is, and they're both drugstore. So there you go, Rimmel Insta Flawless. It's a perfecting radiant primer. So there's this one here I will use, and then the Master Prime primer. Uh, blur and Illuminate from Maybelline. This one is the Blur and Illuminate. So it will blur the lines, pores and all, plus Illuminate. So yes, love this one. This one actually reminds me, which it, actually Laura Geller Spackle, her Champagne Spackle, I don't have any more. If you can get Champagne Spackle, yes, get that. That will give you the glow that you're looking for too, or her Ethereal, which that's what this one reminds me of, her Ethereal um, primer, the spackle. Yes, Laura, Laura Geller for sure. Uh, this I actually add in some foundations that I have that doesn't, like, they're not matte. They're just, you know, there's no, they're not a matte foundation, but um, they're semi, they're like maybe a satin finish. Or I do have, I might have some matte foundations, but they're not a flat matte. Oh my goodness, if it's a flat matte, forget it. I cannot do a flat matte foundation. Not really, no. It, I don't know, I just don't like it. But this came in my BoxyCharm, so I've been using it. And it's a liquid glow, so anything that's like this, uh, put a little dropper in. I did do that with mine today. I actually added it to my regular uh, it CCs. This I have from Wonder Beauty. Now Wonder Beauty did send me this to try out and they didn't tell me to do any review or anything like that. They just sent it to me to see, you know, what I thought because they knew I liked some of their products. And this is the On The Glow Bronzer and it comes in a tube where one side is like a bronzing uh, product. I think that's the bronzing side, isn't it? I believe so, because then the other side is more, oh no, that, that side was more highlight. This side is more of your bronzer. So there's like one side that's like a bronzing bronzer, and then the other one's more highlight, kind of a bronzing, you know. This is really nice. It is it is cream form, so if you don't like cream form, you might not like it, but I like it, and I did use it today, and just carve out a little bit here, and yeah, it gives a really nice, um, natural kind of a bronzy glow. It doesn't give like that orange color. I don't like the orange. So I really like this. I get blushes, Hot Mama. Hot Mama, I have it, but I'm not sure where it's at. And I didn't have time to like finish looking, so I wanted to get this up. But Hot Mama from The Balm is one I like. It gives a nice, beautiful, it's like a peachy glow. It's like orgasm. Like even though it's orgasm, if you have that, I mean, that that's the kind of look the hot mama gives. But I also feel like these are going to play a good role for on them days. And this one's the California from Benefit. I was talking about it in one of my uh, last videos. And it's a beautiful, like, 
peachy, orangey, corally, I don't know, beautiful color. But do you see how it has like that beautiful, uh, sh like a shine to it, like a luminous kind of a look. So any kind of blushes like this. And also from it, the Vitality, love the disc, it's Vitality disc. My whole bronzer smashed out. So <laughs> if the bronzer is gone, that's what happened. It smashed out. But this blush here that they have in it is like a beautiful peach color. And again, it gives you that beautiful, you know, healthy, glowy look. What would be a glow without highlighter? Ronalyn Nipo, if a lot of you guys don't know who Ronalyn is, she's my friend over from Hawaii, lover to death. And she sent me, we did a box exchange, and she sent me some of these from Makeup Revolution. Revolution? Yeah. Makeup Revolution, and they're similar to the Too Faced, heart shaped. This one's like a bronzy glow. So this is another form that you can, and you can use it as highlight or bronzer. So I guess that's where I was going with this is highlight and bronzer. This one is the triple baked bronzer, hot summer of love. I have two from ColourPop that I love and they're the cream, they're in the pots. I haven't tried their pressed powder of those, but these ones are in the pots. Love both of these. This one, I don't know if you can get anymore. It was in the Hello Kitty last year um, kit that they had out, and it's actually called Yummy Cookies. <laughs> Yummy Cookies, but you know, here's this one here, Yummy Cookies. That's what this one looks like. Oh, it's so pretty. Right there it is, Yummy Cookies. This one's one of my favorites. I love this one, and this is Monster. <laughs> crazy name but it has like this shift to it it's a duochrome one so it has like purple and pink in there and yeah that's what it's called monster there there right there you go perfect right there so champagne pop is one of my favorites which you guys probably have all seen so champagne pop and love that one affordable one guys uh the precious petals from wet n wild Definitely pick that one up if you, you know, want a nice affordable highlight. Right there it is. I mean, seriously, look at that glowy. Right down there, you can see. Just beautiful. Crazy rock. I love, I want to get one other one of theirs. This is Moonlight. You probably see me talk about this one here. Mm. And they're very velvety smooth. Whoops, there it is there. I put that one on top here. And these ones are very nice if you don't, they, it, it looks like it's part of your skin. So it gives you that natural glow. Obviously guys, obviously it was going to be in here. My Laura Mercier, which I showed in my last video, but this is my favorite highlight. Honestly, I, I'm definitely getting, getting the other one. There's just no question. I'm done contemplating on it. I'm just, I'm getting it. But this is the indiscretion one and oh just i love that highlighter it's like just definitely my favorite thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it if you did like this video please give me a thumbs up that helped me out so much and put a smile on my face make sure you go ahead and check out the ladies that i mentioned they'll be down below and you know go and check them out subscribe if you like and uh you know maybe they might have something that you guys are interested in and if you are not subscribed to my channel or you came from one of the other ladies welcome and i hope you stick around and join me each week there's a subscribe button down below you can click on it and then right next to it is a bell so you want to hit the subscribe button and then you want to hit the bell and the bell when you hit that it will notify you of when my videos are uploaded every week, you'll get an email notification. So make sure you hit the subscribe and also the bell. And as always, bees, please remember to be yourself, love yourself, and let the real beauty shine through. So until the next time, you take care. Bye. We'll see you then. Love you guys. Take care. Bye.